Okay, guys. Welcome to the last part. Putting it all back together. So, we're going to first put the strut back in. Get that bolted and tightened up. The spindle will, uh, I'm sorry, not spindle. Um, then we're going to put, yeah, then we're going to put the spindle back on. Tighten all that up. Attach the wiring. Put on the uh, brake caliper. And last but not least, do the tie rod end. And uh, pretty much I'm just going in reverse of how I took it apart. Because it's just the easiest way. So, let's get started here. I'm going to drop it over the axle. You're going to lift up the upper control arm. That's in. Then sweep this back over like so. That secures it at the top. Now we we'll secure it at the bottom. What I did is I'm gonna I'm gonna lot the bolt with some anti seize. My favorite. Once again, this is really to help. You guys out when you're doing this job, say again in a couple of years or wherever, you don't have to worry about, you know, oh, the bolts seized in there. You don't want to put rusty bolts back in. Well, add these seas, keep the water out, keep everything good. If you ever have to replace the bolt, I'm sure you can find it. A little help. Okay. Give it a little persuasion from the hammer. That's all the way through. No, it's not. Now let's 
it's all the way through. Okay. Not on the other side. I'm gonna lock it down. Some up back on. Junk, that was stiff. Okay, and we're going to tighten up our upper and lower ball joints. I seem to have lost the cotter pin for the top one. It's okay because I have one. It's 
Sometimes if the old one comes out pretty easy, you can reuse it. Start with the wheel speed sensor. Impact, electric impact, tighten everything down. brake system. I'm going to have to do that after I put it back on the caliper actually. Okay, let's set the rotor on.
And tie rod end last because exactly this. You can turn this whole thing on, tighten everything up. but not least, tie rod end. That's a wrap. That's it. Now you just put the tire back on and you're all set to roll down the road. Get the alignment done, you're good to go. Um, I kind of wish I took before shots to show you guys how low this thing was, but uh, anyway, you can imagine. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. I appreciate you guys giving uh, love and support to my channel. Uh, Mopar man working on something foreign. Um, but 
I'm happy to help my neighbors and happy to help this kid out. You know. So, it's all done. It's ready for alignment. Like I said, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and um, there's more videos to come. Don't worry.